You know, out in the field, one of the most common questions I get anymore is, hey, do you have a replacement for TMG? Well, we do, but it really depends on what you want to do with it. In other words, what are you using your TMG for? We offer forward proxy, we offer reverse proxy, we offer all kinds of things like remote access, layer seven firewalls, layer three, layer four firewalls. There's a whole host of functionality that's available from the big IP to replace what TMG provided. So now, when we talk about things like forward proxy, we're talking about three major functionalities. We're talking about, once again, forward web proxy. In other words, are we actually obfuscating and hiding that client from the outside? Are we acting as that intermediary device that receives the connections, makes the connections to the internet, and delivers content to the end user in the, in the back end? We're also talking about, of course, URL and content filtering. In other words, we need to have the ability to actually filter based upon URLs, based upon accepted domains, accepted access policies, based upon the type of content that we're actually going to access. And perhaps the most important feature, from my perspective, is user access control. In other words, can we restrict access or grant access to users based upon who they are, where they're coming from, and even the time of day that they're trying to access these resources. So when you take into consideration a, a, a TMG or Threat Management Gateway Array, as you can see, typically the TMG servers are deployed in an array, and the reason why they're there is for high availability and scalability. And to achieve that, of course, you need to have some kind of a mechanism to balance the traffic. In our case here, we're doing hardware load balancers. Very common in this case as well, we're doing the big IP as a load balancer on both sides. So essentially, you have a sandwich of TMG servers. So in this case, the TMG array provides forward web proxy content. In other words, it's going to do content and URL filtering. It does have the ability to base decisions on user access. In other words, you can apply policies to groups. Certain websites are allowed. Certain URLs are allowed. In addition to that, it's going to block and look for content in malware. And it can actually do that with not just HTTP traffic, but HTTPS traffic as well. In other words, it can decrypt and encrypt. Now, with the introduction of the F5 Secure Web Gateway, or SWG solution, you actually have the ability to deploy a comprehensive forward proxy solution on the same big IP platform that's used for things like load balancing traffic, for reverse proxy, for pre-authentication as well as things like our layer three, layer four, and layer seven firewall sources. By doing this, you have the advantage of our highly scalable and performance-oriented architecture that simplifies down your infrastructure compared to what you would have in a TMG environment. Now let's take a look at the F5 Secure Web Gateway features. Right off the bat, it's a forward proxy. In other words, it's actually gonna receive connections on behalf of clients making that request. It's gonna to go to the internet, download the content, evaluate the content, and that's whether it's encrypted or not encrypted, and then pass that content once inspected into the end user. In conjunction with Forward Web Proxy, SWG provides URL and content filtering. F5 integrates with WebSense to provide a categorization database of over 40 million website URLs. From a technical perspective, perhaps the most interesting part of SWG is its ability to apply user access controls. Now that SWG is actually part of the APM or Access Policy Manager module. What that means is we have the ability now to apply controls based upon very specific user attributes. I can make decisions based upon a user's group membership, where a user's coming from, what type of device a user's coming in on, and apply policies very specific to that user in that instance. Ensuring that policies are enforced and appropriately configured is essential to both compliance as well as HR. In conclusion, with F5 Secure Web Gateway, we have that last piece of the TMG replacement puzzle. Whether you're looking to replace reverse proxy, Layer 3, Layer 4, or even Layer 7 firewall functionality, or forward proxy, F5 has a solution for you.